Well, it looks like I'm going to have another opportunity to talk about Zach Cassian today. Even though he's only scored two goals so far, they've both been huge. That, combined with his very unique look, has him quickly becoming a legend amongst Oilers fans. What's happening here has an uncanny resemblance to Fernando Pisani's breakthrough in the 2006 playoffs. Now the thing is, a lot of people are under this impression that Pisani was a one-hit wonder. You know, this blue-collar worker comes out of nowhere and just plays out of his mind for a few months. What an incredible Cinderella story. This unknown comes out of nowhere. Now, although that makes a great storyline, it's not entirely accurate. It's actually a little bit of a misconception. Fernando Pisani was an extremely versatile role player for the Oilers from 2002 to 2010. And in the 2005-2006 season, like many Oilers, he had a career high in goals, assists, and points, but he did it playing primarily on the third line. Really, he was the beneficiary of an extremely deep team. The Oilers were able to slot him properly in the lineup. Now, as we all know, these role players are often the guys that can make the difference in a playoff series. And did he ever? And after that run, the Oilers really didn't have much of a choice but to pay the man. So they inked him to a four-year, $10 million deal. Now, he was going to have a difficult time living up to the contract to begin with, but his career was completely derailed by injury and illness. Pisani would only play 211 of 328 games during his four-year contract. Now, Cassian finds himself in a similar situation in that a casual observer might look at his stats and say 24 points from this right winger that's bounced from team to team over the last few years, that's nothing special. But if you take into account that he had four, count them, four disallowed goals this year, including this beautiful snipe against the Jets, as well as this deflection goal that was credited to Adam Larson two whole days after the game, and you tack that onto his numbers, you start to realize that he's a pretty effective third-line producer. Now, I'm not saying that Cassian's going to score 14 goals in these playoffs. That'd be ridiculous. But there is no denying he has been the X factor so far. The fact that McDavid doesn't even have an even-strength point and the Oilers find themselves with a 2-1 series lead, that speaks volumes about Cassian's contribution. So, I am going to go on record by saying, if Cassian scores one more goal in this series, I'm going to do what I've seen a lot of other people do on social media, and that is shave my beard into the chops. Now, I know my wife's not going to be too happy about that, but I think I can sell her on it by saying, hey, at least a third of my beard will be gone, right? Let's go Oilers.